What's so funny, TSM? <laughs> It's the makeup nurse, you better fix your ways. The makeup nurse, she about to fix your face. It's the makeup nurse, you better fix your ways. It's the makeup nurse, she about to fix your face. The makeup nurse, 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 the makeup nurse. It's the makeup nurse, you better fix your ways. The makeup nurse. She bout to fix your face, it's the makeup nurse You better fix yeah. your face, it's the makeup nurse She bout to fix your face, makeup I'm back, welcome back to my channel The Struggle is Real with the Makeup Nurse Today is Two Tart Tuesday And it's also right down your story day children's craft day learn about butterflies day potato chip day and pie day i i was i was like looking through my palettes um but of course it's still kind of cluttered um i couldn't find anything with pie from too far tart or uh, too faced or tart so hmm interesting so anyway let's get started i'm going to start with the tart awake serum so I don't know if I do have anything with a pie. I know I have to. Oh well. And today I have an interview with you guys. So after I film this, I gotta try to do something with this and this. At least the top half. Then I'm gonna go in with the tart baba bomb. Because it's um video so i have to at least look presentable from here up and we're gonna go in with the shadow insurance from too faced the eye primer In this interview, I'm more than likely going to be going to Minnesota, so we'll see how this goes. Oh, not Minnesota. Oh, my gosh. Massachusetts. All right. We're going to use the Tarte Dream On palette. So, look how pretty that is. All right. And we're going to use the Magic sh oh, smells so good. Magic Shade for Transition. The nice thing about being an interim, when you have, when the clients, or when, when the company puts you in for an interview, more than likely you've got it, because um, they just want a body. Um, so, all right, we're gonna go in with this fairy shade. I mean, unless you totally blow it, and they're like, yeah, no, give me, bring me somebody else. But if they like you on paper, like most of the time they really don't ask me any questions so that's the nice part of it
All right, now we're going to use the chocolate matte eyeshadow in the shade Amaretto. I think I smell the chocolate today. Okay, then we're going to use this shade. Actually, you know what? Let's, hmm. Okay, let's first put on this crystal shade. You guys, I'm sorry about the lighting. Um, oh. I'm gonna have to just do it on my finger. Um, here, I don't have the greatest lighting. Not like I do at the hotel. Okay, and now let's go in with um, Trance, the darker shade. So hopefully this is just temporarily. And I was like, well, maybe I shouldn't just skip videos, but I don't want to skip videos. So hopefully it's not too dark for you. Okay, and then let's go in with this mystic shade. Oh, I was going to do that shade anyway. Oh well. Maybe I'll go to Walmart and get another light or something. Because this is... If I had time to do that before my interview, I would just pause this and go... Hmm. That might be an idea. All right, well, I sent Ken to Walmart and even the um, lighting, the actual lights is not working out. What's going on? But anyway, I'm going to use the Tarte Tist eyeliner and I'm running out of time. I got to get my face on. So I apologize for the lighting. I'll figure it out, I guess. Let's do the wing. Now we're going to use the Tarte Rose Gold um, Eyeliner. So hopefully it doesn't look as bad when I upload as what it looks like right now. I hope it's just somewhat my camera looking really bad and it's not as dark as what it looks like while I'm filming. Cause it looks really bad from what I'm looking at right here. Okay. Alright, now I'm going to use this Too Faced Hangover Primer. I do smell it, 
but I'm not sure what it smells like. It's like a sweet smell. Okay, and then we're going to use this Tarte C Golotion. And we're going to put that there. And then we're going to take the Too Faced Born This Way foundation and we're going to put it next to it. So we have a little bit of a glow with full coverage foundation and I went with the full coverage because of my energy. and then I'm gonna just take the brush again the Too Faced brush and this is the Mr. Perfect brush foundation brush and we're gonna mix the two And I do prefer a sponge, but we gotta use the Too Faced brushes. But we can, but the concealer, we can use the sponge, kind of blend it together again and get rid of some of the streaks. All right, we're gonna use the Tarte uh, Ultra Creamy Concealer. And I like this concealer, it's the creamy. I don't know why, like in my hotel, I have the same setup and um, it doesn't seem to be this dark. All right. I have to hurry this up. Oh, I think I got the sponge too wet because I took some of it off. All right, now we're going to go in with the Tarte Cream Bronzer in the shade Breezy. Maybe. There we go. Okay, let's... Okay, let's blend this now. <laughs> now my dog is shaking the table. Oh, 
Okay, now we're going to go on with the Peach Bloom Lip and Cheek Tint in the shade Strawberry Glow. Ah, it smells so good too. I think I'm running out of this. I use it quite a bit though. Okay. Get a slight glow. All right, now we're gonna use the Tarte Sunshine Stick, the liquid highlight. And all that. Alrighty. Now we're going to use the Tarte Shape Tape Setting Powder. Alright, let's. Get a little more in. Put on my face. Now we're going to use the Too Faced Do You with the Too Faced Mr. Right Now brush. Oh, that's my granddaughter. Really get it around my nose. Okay, we're gonna use the Too Faced um, this highlighter brush, but I use it for bronzer, and I'm gonna use the Too Faced Milk Chocolate Soleil. I love this one. This tastes like chocolate. Okay, then we're going to contour our nose. Get a little chocolate. Now let's blend. Let's blend this right here a little more. 
All right, for the blush, I'm going to use this blush shade in here. I don't know. It doesn't really give you a name for the blush. It is light, which is fine. Okay, then we are going to use the highlighter brush by Too Faced, the Mr. Chisel. It's actually a, a contour brush. I'm going to use the Sugar Peach Palette. I tried to make it real, oh, look, you guys, all the way home by driving. I had it separate in the box. I'm going to use the Peach Pearl Highlight. I was wondering how. I mean, it is powdery, really powdery over here, but um, it did break apart some, but still somewhat intact. So not bad. Okay, now we're going to use... Okay, we're going to use this to contour. You don't really need that much because that brush did pretty good. And this highlight is really high. It's very pigmented. Okay, but let's blend everything. Okay, then we're going to use the Too Faced Chocolate Brownie for eyeshadow or for brows. Smells like chocolate brownies. Let's go in with this um, magic shade that we use for transition and mix it with this mystic shade. Give it a little bit of a glow. Okay, let's blend that in with a beauty brush. Now we're going in with the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I think this one's pretty close to being empty. Alright, now we're going to use the Tarte, the Lip Architect, the shade Cutie Pie for the lip liner. Oh, I got outside of the line. Oh, that's real great. Oh well. And then we're going to use the Gingerbread Too Faced Matte Lipstick. Oh, got outside of that line too. I'm not doing very good with the lines. Okay, while that's drying down, Let's put some 
I didn't spray on. Oh, actually, wait, no. Let's finish our eyes. Ooh, I just hit my dog. All right, um, we're gonna use, let's see. Let's use Marvel for right above our eye. And let's use the pixie for in the corner. Okay, for gloss, we're going to use the melted chocolate liquefied metallic lipstick. Oh, I forgot it's an actual shade. I thought it was clear. Oh well. Ooh, I do smell the chocolate. Alright, now we're going to use the Peach Mist Mattifying Setting Spray. And I do smell it. All right, this is the final look. Hopefully you guys can see it. If you can't, I'm sorry about this video. Um, but anyway, the riddle of the day is, which animal can never take a long bubble bath? Comment down below. See you next time. Bye!